Hey, home learning heroes, we're back with week three of unit 18, level two. We're gonna do some home reading together, so follow along with me. We're gonna read it two times, of course. The first time we'll talk about it, and then we'll read it for fluency, so we'll get really good at reading. All right, today's story is called My Diary. Now, we've had some time to explore what a diary is, but if you forget, a diary is a book. Uh, that you would write down what happens during your day and you can put your feelings in there and your events and also sometimes you don't want anyone else to read your diary so you can put a lock on it right here and maybe secret so nobody can see all right let's take a look at it together please my diary I see that you have a picture on one side and then the diary page is on the other side. So I might have to move my camera a little bit. First, let's look at the picture side. Uh, we just read this. If you haven't yet, go back to week two. This is Florence and Drago and they are eating their spicy chili soup and their tears are pouring from their eyes. And see these bubbles? Bloop, bloop, bloop. She is remembering that event and she's going to write it down for the day in her diary. All right, I'm gonna move my camera whoop, over to the other side there. Now, we can look on this side, and I have a date at the top because a diary needs to have a date, so you remember what day it was that the thing happened. This is Sunday, 17th January, and then you can write down the thing. We can read this together, and I'll put mine underneath. At dinner time, I ate some chili soup with Drago my pet dragon the tears poured from our eyes and then look at the little picture of them going so hot i kind of want to try some spicy food maybe tonight for dinner just from reading all these stories all right tears poured from their eyes that's the language that we've seen a lot pretty good now we have the next page and it's another day and again Little Florence is thinking about what she remembers. And I can see there's a bus and there she is. And look who's behind her. But remember what happens when you can see through Drago? That means he's invisible, which means no one else can see him. And there are all the students waiting to get it back to school. And then let's read here, Monday, 18th January. Today, Drago went to school with me. No one could see him. We went on the minibus. Wouldn't that be fun to take your pet dragon to school? And there's a picture. All right, another day, and she's writing another thing that happened. Just looking at the picture, I can see that they're in class, and she's raising her, raising her hand, and Drago's right there behind her, but nobody knows. Let's read on the journal side, on the diary. Tuesday, 19th January. Drago went to my classroom. He sat behind me and he never made a noise. He helped me with my maths. The teacher never knew. And there he is, he's got a little giggle because nobody knows. <laughs> All right, moving on to the last page. Make sure, yep, the last page is just the diary and there's a picture here, uh-oh. Remember this from the other story? Drago, you can see him now and I think Charlie can see him too. So she's writing this event. Let's read at the top, Wednesday, 20th January. Today, Drago went to my art class. When Charlie Chung stole my paintbrush, Drago was upset. The smoke poured from his nose. Charlie was scared and tears poured from his eyes. Wow, don't mess with the dragon. Do you see how you can have tears pouring from your eyes, but you can also have smoke pouring from your nose, if you're a dragon, of course. All right, let's take a look at the uh, ha content words. There's a lot today. We'll go through them real quick, okay? You can pause the video and go slower if you want. Sunday, January, dinner, time, chili, soup, drago, pet, dragon, tears, poured, eyes, Monday, school, minibus, Tuesday, class.
classroom, behind, noise, helped, maths, teacher, Wednesday, art, class, Charlie Chung, stole, paint, brush, upset, smoke, nose, scared. We did it. Whew, that was a lot. All right. Now we know all the words. Let's go back to the beginning. We're going to read it for fluency, which is a little faster, a little more energy in the voice, a little bit more pauses. My diary. Remember, you can read along with me or you can just turn off the sound and try on your own. My diary. Sunday, 17th January. At dinner time, I ate some chili soup with Drago, my pet dragon. The tears poured from our eyes. Monday, January 18th January. Today, Drago went to school with me. No one could see him. We went on the minibus. Tuesday, 19th January. Drago went to my classroom. He sat behind me and he never made a noise. He helped me with my maths. The teacher never knew. Wednesday, 20th January. Today, Drago went to my art class. When Charlie Chung stole my paintbrush, Drago was upset. The smoke poured from his nose. Charlie was scared and tears poured from his eyes. Ta-da! All done. Very cool, guys. All right, very quickly, let's do the orientation. The who, the when, and the where. Who's in the story? Same as before, Charlie, uh, Florence, and Drago. When does it happen? During school or maybe after school when she's writing about it. And where? Uh, wherever she's sitting to write down her diary. Events, what happens? She has a few days that she writes down the things that she ha has done that day. Do you remember what they are? Maybe you can go back in the video and find all the different events that happen. Uh, the problem at the very end on the last page, what's the problem? I think Drago got upset with Charlie because Charlie wanted to steal paintbrushes. And in the end, the resolution, what's the ending? How does it end for Florence? She's okay. Charlie's in tears though. He's crying because he's a bit scared. But you know what? Don't steal paintbrushes. All right. Hey, that's week three done. Well, that's very good. I'm glad that you guys got to come and uh, join me for this book. Come back again uh, for week four because that's coming up right now. I'll see you then. Bye-bye.